Hey guys, welcome to the Massive Iron Channel. Steve Shaw, editorial director at TigerFitness.com and Muscle and Brown Nutrition CEO, also known as a big, hairy, ugly dude. I'm driving from Wisconsin to Ohio, and I have a public service announcement for you. Say, so I was in a gym called Club Olympia, and you, those of you guys who follow my channel know I've been doing a lot of traveling over the last three or four years. Been to a lot of gyms, and I'm in this gym, and there's about maybe five to ten people, and I'm sweating. I'm working hard. I'm trying to catch my breath in between sets. Sweat's rolling down my back. I'm moving heavy ass weight. And I look around the gym and I see some people squatting. I see some people benching. I see some people on the treadmill. But the common theme is that no one looks like they're working hard. No one looks like they're working hard. They all look like they're going through the motions. They all look like they came to the gym to do three sets of whatever, or they came to the gym to do 20 minutes on the treadmill or whatever, and they just go in there and they do this lame ass, uninspired work, and then they get out of the gym. Now exercise, this is good. They're exercising, that's great. But you are a power builder. You want to build strength, you want to build muscle. And I gotta tell you, right now, if you're just going through the motions, if you're just going to the gym and putting in your sets and reps, and you don't find yourself dreading half the sets you're doing, you don't find yourself winded a lot in between sets, you don't find yourself busting your balls, you don't find yourself constantly progressing or constantly dreading that next step in progression, something is seriously wrong and you're cutting your progress short. You have to separate yourself from these people that are going to the gym just going through the motions. Again, I'm not ripping on these people. I'm glad to see they're exercising. I'm glad to see they're moving. I'm glad to see they're trying to improve their health and their physical fitness. But look, you aren't there to improve your physical fucking fitness. You're in there to build muscle and strength. And if you want to elevate your game, if you want to really see some quality progress, you're going to have to train and not work out. You're going to have to find some deeper level of inspiration. You're going to have to find some deeper, deeper level of motivation. You don't just go in there and and move weights for three sets of eight reps and just get out of the gym. You're gonna have to you're gonna have to sweat. You're gonna have to you're gonna have to progress. You're gonna have to attack every set. See that's the difference between me and other people I see in the gym. They're not attacking sets. That's why I that's why I preach my system called the rep goal system because it focuses on maximizing every set or making every set count. 95% of people I see training in the gym don't do that. They aren't doing that. So if you want to step up your game, if you want to see faster results, focus on making every set count. Don't waste sets. What is the point in wasting sets? If you're in the gym and you're going to do 15, 16, 18, 20 sets, why not make every set count? Why waste a set? The philosophy I preach and the philosophy I practice is if you maximize every set, you maximize every workout. If you maximize every workout, you maximize your progress. It's as simple as that. Why drag your ass to the gym after a tired day at work or whatever and do uninspired, lame bullshit? Why are you doing that? What's the point? To make yourself feel better? Why don't you just go home and eat some ice cream sandwiches and pat yourself on the fucking back? Instead of doing that bullshit, why don't you go into the gym and make every set count? Then you won't have to worry about volume. Then you won't have to worry about all these bullshits. Is, is 8 to 12 reps better per set? Or is 10 to 12 reps better per set? Or is this exercise better than that exercise? Or all this other bull fucking shit. Instead of worrying about this minutia, kids, instead of worrying about this minutia, focus on making every set count. If you do that, if you push every set to the limit for as many reps as possible, stopping that set when you feel like you might fail on the next rep, when you feel like your form might break down, you're going to progress in strength as, qu as quick as humanly possible. You're going to pack on muscle mass and your results are going to skyrocket. So 
I just wanted to make this video as a public service announcement because, quite frankly, I'm sick and tired of seeing so many uninspired sets, so many uninspired workouts in the gym. Don't be that guy. Step up your game. So guys, hope this video has been of some help. If you have any questions for the big, hairy, ugly dude, all that stuff is below. You can hashtag Ask B H U D, that's a big hairy ugly dude on Twitter, Instagram. Send me a DM on Instagram or hit up my Facebook page. I answer the best questions, I'll turn into a video just like this. So, guys, as always, thanks for watching. Have a great day.